Hello there, boys and girls. Elton McFall here. I'm in Chablis, Quebec, south of Montreal. Perfect summer day, 22, 23 degrees Celsius, early afternoon, 64, Thunderbird, 65 as the... 64, 65? Anyway, one thing's for sure. I'm not sure my camera is actually showing the correct color on this. My camera is showing this is red, but it's it's more like an orange kind of red. And look at this gorgeous white interior. Oh my god, I love a white interior. Look at this thing. It's a cream puff. Cream puff. As I said earlier in another video, one of the many, many cars I filmed. You know, I think to me the 60s T-Birds along with the Riviera was the only cars where the interior and the exteriors were just as amazing. You know? Uh, like, look at this white one, you know, like, not a huge fan of white, but it doesn't matter. These cars are amazing icons, you know. Oh, it's a 65. 65, 66, almost the same, uh, almost the same, same thing. I don't really know much that's different. The only thing I knew about was a 65 was that blue uh, Quebec plate, actually. Such a mean looking wide front end. I would, God, I would love to go for a ride in one of these cars. I just love them. And, and the great thing about these cars is that there's so many of them. You know, like so many muscle cars. They're so well preserved, just like Thunderbirds. I mean, look, there's one here. There's another one there. We'll get to that in a moment. You know. Got the right hubcaps on it. Look at the hubcaps. They actually have some red detailing on them. Is that original? Interesting. I think there is our turn signal indicators, if I'm not mistaken. Lando model, Lando bars. That's how you know it's a Lando model. It's got a vinyl top. This is really your top of the line Thunderbird. Look at this thing. Oh my God, it's just so beautiful. That's a car. Sustern Shaw. That is a machine. Just like this Grand Prix that I filmed many years ago. I don't remember where. You know, this was really the e the emphasis on the personal luxury cars. So you see why I've been addicted to these line nuts ever since I was a kid. I've been addicted to these gas guzzling, earth killing machines. I just love them. I never get enough of them. And it's sad that in this day and age, we have lost thousands and hundreds of classic cars to the Europeans because not enough people here in, in North America care to to buy these cars and restore them and preserve them and. You know, it's just, what are you going to do? Things are, the tides are changing. Things are changing, you know? It is what it is. So that's why I relish in this. I relish in, in recording these things, you know, and, and documenting them for my sake, for your sake, you know? I think this one's also a 65. Eh? Got the same hubcaps, same script, Lando as well, Lando bars, vinyl roof again. That's cool to see two of these very similar. What the hell happened to the skirt over here though? A little damage there, damage. What's the interior look like? Beautiful blue interior. A very original interior. Very original. You can tell because the seats have a little bit of fade on them, nice and original. The more original, the better. Merci d'avoir ramené ça, monsieur, madame. Very nice. Hey, c'est bizarre ce qu'on mis la clé, hein, pour le trunk. My God, that's... C'est bizarre, hein? C'est vrai, ça a l'air d'un crest de Chrysler. Pourquoi ça? Ça, c'est un 65 aussi? J'imagine ça doit être l'année où ils ont fait le plus de ces chars-là, hein, de ce modèle-là, 64 à 66, c'est probablement 65, parce que je, je peux te dire que 65, c'était l'année qui a eu le plus de production d'automobiles. Oh yeah, 65 all the way. Donner un exemple, j'avais, brefement, malheureusement, un Buick Le Sable 65, quatre portes, puis juste ça, ils ont fait comme 40 000. Là, je parle pas du reste, là, les hardtops, les décapotables, juste ce modèle-là. Fait que c'est ça, c'est ça. Pour ça, je dis tout le temps que ça, cette époque-là, c'était, on appelle en anglais, « the golden age of motoring ». Tu sais, Là, vraiment l'âge des automobiles aujourd'hui, c'est, écoute, aujourd'hui, ça se compare pas, c'est tellement cheap. C'est des œuvres d'art, « works of art ». Merci d'avoir ramené ça. Puis j'ai raison, hein, ça a l'air que l'intérieur, ça a l'air original, ça, ça a pas l'air restauré. Ah, ben c'est gentil. C'est quoi, quoi le millage que ça affiche sur la demande? 
C'est quoi le, le millage? C'est quoi le millage? C'est sûr? Ouais, ça se monte. Ça se monte. C'est un char canadien? Oui. Oh, it's beautiful! Avec le, le bois sur les portes, tout le kit. Quoi, vous avez le 65 qui est là aussi? Gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. Oh my God. My God Almighty. Hey, more English people, I like that. Fantastic. Et t'as vente pour combien pour le fun? 